Hiya and welcome back to the Chitrin at C1 again. Uh, don't forget to uh, to smash like and uh, ring the bell button or whatever it is to get some notifications of future videos if you want to see this kind of shit. Right, we're going to test. We're going to test engine restore in this Citroen C1. So we're going to do compression test before, and then we're going to do one after about a thousand miles or whatever it says on it. I'm not read it yet, but I'll read it, and then we'll. Uh, you can read it if you want. And then we'll do a, we'll do another compression test and see if it's actually done anything. Um, I'm only really trying this because Project founded it and it worked. So let's uh, let's get some compression results. Right, this is number one before. Fucked at depth just like you're driving it. Yes, and we was in gear. That actually wasn't a setup. Right, let's do it again. Fucked at floor. Right, now let's do the other two. Oh yeah, it's raining as well, and these cars tend to, uh, tend to leak. We're good at that. All right, this is number two. Pops up floor. It's got the focus on. And number three. Before. Uh, sun's in it, I can't see now. Well, not the sun, just a the light, there isn't any sun. Pissing down. <laughs> it's not going any higher. Now that's quite boring, that, because all three cylindricals are about the same they're all about 200 psi according to this gauge if it's accurate i mean it's snap on it should be half decent but it seems a lot for this car but i'll have to see what it's meant to be um but they're all about the same which i was hoping to have one that was lower to see if it had come back but we'll, we'll do it anyway we'll we'll put it in anyway i mean we've got the oil it's so clean i mean it's up to about three quarters ish but it's so clean from the oil flush that I did a few months ago, a few weeks ago. Yeah, about two weeks ago. You can't actually, you can't even fucking see it. But I'm going to put this engine restore in, which is a bit of a darker colour. And then we might be able to at least see the oil, if nothing else. It'll just show us where the oil is. Which will be worth 26 quid or 24 quid or whatever I waste on it. Well, let's try it. The, uh, this is the stuff. And that's the colour. Let's put it in. We're going in at 100 and... 30,458 mile. See if I can get it all in without spilling it. Right. Right, well, it's been that many miles, whatever it was from last time, and uh, we're going to test it with engine restore with the same inaccurate. Well, suspiciously inaccurately reading high compression tester, so it's not it's not a different one. So let's see what it's reading now. Make sure it's out of gear this time. Right, let's see what it does. You ready? Well, that's made no difference at all. Right, cylinder two after. difference I don't think you'll have to compare it. And finally turn the three. Oh. Yeah. Right so in conclusion doesn't seem to have made any difference on this engine which wasn't low on compression anyway but it was it was interesting to see um now that's a bit disappointing because i was hoping it would have done something 
but to uh, stem the disappointment, to uh, compensate for it, we'll have some uh, slow motion new boot foot tapping coming up.